The third of Bollywood's three Khans may not have been present in person in Pathan, but Amir Khan's elder sister Nikhat was definitely there. She set the internet on fire when she shared on social media still from a scene where she appears with Shah Rukh Khan in the film Pathan. In the movie, Nikhat Khan Hegde played an Afghan woman who can be seen blessing SRK in the scene. Pathan also stars Deepika Padukone, John Ibrahim. Dimple Kapadia and Ashutosh Rana. The film has been released in three languages, Hindi, Tamil and Telugu. In terms of worldwide collection, the film reportedly has minted Rs 100 crore, an achievable feat given the SRK enjoys a rock-solid fan following among the Indian diaspora. Abdul Razik, who was most recently seen on Big Boss 16 and is popular Tajikistani singer, was spotted outside Shah Rukh Khan's home in Mumbai, Mannat, showing his love for the superstar along with other fans, waiting outside to meet and greet their hero. In a picture going viral on social media, Abdul was seen standing through the sunroof of a car and wearing a placard around his neck which said, I still haven't made it until I meet you. I love you, Shah Rukh Khan. So happy to sit here with all of your fans and wait for my turn. Only one dream left, Pathan. Abdu can be heard shouting in a video showing his love for SRK saying, I love Shah Rukh Khan. After being in the news for all the wrong reasons, Pathan has made a grand opening, settling the record for the highest opening day collection by a Bollywood film. Directed by Siddharth Anand, Pathan also stars Deepika Padukone, John Abraham, Dimple Kapadia and Ashutosh Rana. Abdu will next be seen in the Salman Khan starer Kisi Ka Bhai Kisi Ki Jaan. Actors Alaya F and Karan Mehta have shared their experience of shooting for Anurag Kashyap's almost pair with DJ Mohabbat in extremely cold conditions in Gulmar. Talking about shooting in sub-zero conditions, Alaya said, The weather was extremely erratic. It was snowing one day, then the next day was bright and sunny, then there was heavy rainfall the following day. But the harsh weather did not stop the film's crew from being creative. Alaya recalled, It was a wonderful learning experience seeing Anurag sir adapt to every weather condition and not let it hinder the making of the film. She added, It was one of a kind experience because one day we were freezing and the next day we were drenched. There were also times when we could barely see when where we were going due to dense fog. It was always a distinct experience and an amazing adventure which made for the most incredible memories. Debutant Karan was faced, but he tried to make the best out of the situation. It was really difficult to shoot in such unfavorable conditions. But with the support and encouragement we received from the crew members, we were able to sail through. When I saw the first cut, I realized all our efforts were worth it for sure. Presented by Z Studios under the banner of Good Bad Films, Almost Pyar with DJ Mohabbat releases on February 3rd. Filmmaker choreographer Farah Khan will be replacing actor Salman Khan as a host during the weekend cover episode of the reality show Big Boss 16 and will be seen getting strict with the contestants. Anil Kapoor, Kartik Aran, Kriti Sanan and Mika Singh will be making an appearance on the show this week as special guests. During the episode, Farah seems unhappy with the behaviour of Tina Datta and Priyanka Chahar Chaudhary. She slammed them for continuously bullying Shalin Bhanot. This led to an argument between the three. Tina and Priyanka continued to argue with the host and tried to explain their viewpoint. However, this irritated Farah. Farah tried to make them understand but after a point she got annoyed and said, If you don't want to listen to me, I'll walk out. Big Boss 16 airs on Colors. Sasha Shinde, who appeared on the reality show Lockup and recently underwent facial feminization surgeries, has shared her experience and also expressed her gratitude to the surgeons for completing the procedures successfully. Feminization involves a series of procedures that helps a man undergoing a sex change get a feminine look. It includes having lips and cheekbones augmented, the jaw and chin reshaped and resized and other such steps. Sasha shared pictures of her transformation and wrote a note, I came out publicly to live a free life without any expectations as to what it will result in. And today I want to show my face without any expectations. 
but I want to be free and I want to be happy. So here I am with makeup and without before my facial feminization surgery and after. The celebrity designer added, there is still a lot of swelling. As I take this pic and the doc has assured me it's only going to get better here on. Earlier too, she had shared pictures of her body transformation. Saisha Shinde, formerly Swapnil Shinde, is a fashion designer. She came out as trans woman early in 2021. Bollywood actor Sunny Deol's Gadar, which shattered box office records 22 years ago, is returning with its sequel. The first poster from the sequel, titled Gadar 2, was unveiled on Thursday and it shows an intense Tara Singh played by Sunny holding a hammer. The film has also set its release date as August 11, 2023. The Sunny Deol and Amisha Patel star created an insurmountable stir in Bollywood when it released in 2001 and clashed against Amir Khan's Oscar-nominated Lagan. Helmed by director-producer Anil Sharma and produced by Z Studios, the new movie stars Sunny Deol, Amisha Patel and Utkar Sharma in lead roles. Taking the direct-to-digital route, the Yami Gautam Dhar star film Lost is all set to drop on OTT on February 16. The film has been helmed by Anirudh Roy Chaudhary of Pink Fame. Written by Shamil Sen Gupta with dialogues by Ritesh Shah, Lost is based in Kolkata and is inspired by true events. The film is an investigative thriller that tells the story of a bright young crime reporter in a relentless search for the truth behind the sudden disappearance of a young theatre activist. It further represents a higher quest and search for lost values of empathy and integrity. Produced by Z Studios and Nama Pictures, Lost will premiere on Z5 from February 16. Happy outfits, happy weeks, spread some love and give appreciation for the celebrity looks in the lead as we summarize it all for you. Have we not dipped out toys finally into 2023? And how tricky are we rewriting stories of our style? To get into all the best fashion fields, we have a guide that is stylish and dandy. Katrina Kaif for us tailor and sweet something. Choose Ritika geometric high-low anarkali two-piece set. Styled by Ami Patel, the phone booth actress wore a pair of jutis and tired earrings that added to the elegance of her look. Deepika Padukone, just easy to look excellent, style up with your partner in ethnic outfits. The stars of 83 movie dressed up into Atorani Sari and Rohit Gandhi and Rahul Khanna Sherwani. Your looks for a wedding can be accessorized with impact adders such as a choker, necklace, statement chain and drop earrings. Men can go with polished shoes or mujaris to complete their looks. Anya Bhatt, we do love our pen suit, but only a comfortable pair will have our attention for life. All hearts for the couple and Gangubai Katewari actress's stylish three-piece ensemble which was accessorized with the mini hoop earrings and rings. Disha Pati, cheers to a fun party, cheers to a sexy you. She dazzled wholly in a you self AI dress me plunking neckline embellished gown which also have a thing high slit. The egg villain returns actress was such a bombshell who was styled by Mohit Rai and Steppy Stitios. Suhana Khan, the party glamour is real. Say yes to all the doses in a tutus kurniati mini dress. Mohit Rai gave the cheese actress in a pair of ankle strap stilettos and mini drop earrings that were a glittery treat to her eyes. Suram Kapoor, purple is in the only nice hue we know. Thanks Riya Kapoor and team. The Nerja actress opted for a custom and this is coordinated midi skirt set. Her coat is the warmest layer of comfort you need. Style perfectly with black boots from Stuart. A mini handbag and studded drop earrings. Well, I like it. Never miss an update.